into all truth, meaning solves all your problems. The Holy Bible doesn't do that. Jesus Christ himself, he says, I've got many things to say and you are incapable of receiving it. And he didn't give you and nor uh, the Holy Ghost has told any church in, uh, in this past 2000 years, solution to the problem of race, solution to the problems of alcoholism, solution to the problem of surplus women. There are dozens of problems to which this book does not give an answer. Whereas Jesus Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Longu back with another reaction video. And today, guys, as you can see, I'm just filled with so so much joy. I think I mentioned in one of the previous videos that today I finally wrote my final exam and I can start enjoying myself now. And which means I'll be graduating, and graduation is in a couple of days. So I just, I don't know, I can't contain myself, I've been forgetting things, I guess I've been forgetting things, just doing things, I don't, I don't know what's going on with me, I'm just, I'm confused yet so excited. So yeah, other than that, if you're new to this channel, like I said, I'm Fanny Lungu, make sure to subscribe, like, and of course share with your friends, and of course feel free to comment anything that you would like, make a suggestion, anything that you want. So yeah, we'll be creating a new channel soon. I'm sure by the time this video will be going up, we'll have created a, a new channel. Make sure to go to that channel, subscribe. Make sure to go to Jesse's personal channel. Also subscribe to that. I don't have a personal channel, so you can find me here. Um, for the new channel, before I forget, for the new channel, you can comment either on this channel, what you want us to do on the other place what kind of vlogs you want us to do on the other side and we'll do them for you so other than that i would like to talk about we've got podcasts as well so we've got podcasts and it's got some interesting topics make sure to listen to that we have you can find us you can listen to our podcast on itunes there's we usually post an mp3 link on our Facebook and other social medias and you can also listen to it on YouTube actually and the last thing that I want to talk about before I get into the video is we also have a Patreon account Patreon account for some videos that we can't post on this channel we would love to post them on the other side so guys just make sure that you become a Patreon and support us the other side as well so yes today people have been requesting People have been requesting that we react to Amit the Tat and today I stumbled upon this interesting video entitled Amit the Tat answer why do you claim Islam to be the true religion? I'm curious to know what the answer is and I'm curious to know what other information is told in this video. So without wasting time guys, let's get into the video. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Dr. Didat, what day is it today? <laughs> is that the, just, uh, let's, uh, just, just one thing, minute, please. Uh, I'm going to allow you one question, so please ask the pertinent question, and yes. otherwise, if you're going to have one I leading to, up, I, I might stop you at the wrong place. That's right. I want to relate it to the scripture. I want to know what day it is today. All right, I can answer that to you. Thank you. It's Tuesday, the 12th. It is Tuesday, the 12th. Right. Home, 1900? 88. 88. When has that started? What means 1988? No, 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 no. Uh, you're referring to the year of the Lord type of thing. The Lord. Yeah, but no, I've the answered. Lord has created that day when the start of the Bible, of the New Testament, from that day, when you go back <coughs> to history, 640 years has the Quran been written. All right, well, now what is the Yesaya, question? Yesaya, sorry. Uh, what is your question? To you? My question is, how do you know what you believe is true? Thank you. Thank you. Right. You see, there are numerous, numerous reasons which makes me to believe that this book is true. 
numerous reasons. Number one, this book was given through a man who didn't know how to read or write. What we call an ummi in Arabic, unlettered. He brought this book about. The very physical size of this book, if this was Muhammad's production, compared to the Holy Bible, 40 different authors wrote this book. 40 different people went along to produce this book. This is one man job. One man's failure. <laughs> who said that? I said that. Which man? Who said that? I said that. No, 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 no. Thank you. Please, 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 please. Please, please. Don't do that. You see, this book, this book supplies the answer to what Jesus said. He said, I have yet many things to say unto you, but ye cannot bear them now. How be it? When he, the spirit of truth, is come, he will guide you into all truth. This book guides mankind into all truth, meaning solves all your problems. The Holy Bible doesn't do that. Jesus Christ himself, he says, I got many things to say and you are incapable of receiving it. And he didn't give you and nor uh, uh, the Holy Ghost has told any church in, uh, in this past 2000 years, solution to the problem of race, solution to the problems of alcoholism, solution to the problem of surplus women. There are dozens of problems to which this book does not give an answer. Whereas Jesus Christ prophesied that there's somebody coming after me and it is he who will give you a solution to all your problems. Then in the book of Isaiah, chapter 29, verse 12, you read there a prophecy. He says, and the book, the book is given to him that is not learned. And Ummi saying, Iqra, read. And he says, Ma ana He said, I'm not learned. The book, what book is, is he talking about? Which prophet said, I am not learned. Now if you read the history of Muhammad, his life, the first revelation that was given to him in the cave of Hira, the archangel Gabriel comes to him and commands him in his mother tongue, Iqra, read, and he says, Ma'ana biqari, I am not learned. A word for word fulfillment from the book of Isaiah. Then in the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 18, verse 19, it says, and it shall come to pass, that whosoever will not hearken unto my words, which he, that prophet mentioned in 1818, speaks in my name, so I will require it of him. Now, he said, that prophet speaking in my name, in whose name is Muhammad speaking? The Lord's name. No, he says, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, in the name of God, most gracious, most merciful, so Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim in the name of God most gracious most merciful kul auzu bil nas Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim every chapter of the Quran begins with the formula in the name of God most gracious most merciful now these are all the fulfillments which goes to prove
And that was quite interesting to listen to. Um, I'm really not a fan of how people use one thing to answer another question like the comparison. I guess maybe that's the only way to answer these religion related uh, questions. From what I got from this is the main thing I got from this message is that um, the Quran has it's more like it's got answers to everything and it can solve your problems. While the Bible on the other hand, hmm, I guess information has been withheld from the people because they can't handle what would be said. It's quite interesting. Like I said, I really don't have much to say about this. I'd like someone or everyone watching this to shed more light on this message. Feel free to educate me. Tell me whatever you want me to learn from this. Give me more information. Make me understand more and more from this video. Otherwise, it wasn't so bad at all. It wasn't. Finally, we got to. Finally, I got to react to the famous Ahmad Tad that's been requested time and time after again. Let me know how you feel about my reaction and how you feel about this video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Subscribe button. Like it and of course share it with your friends and don't forget to check out our Patreon, our podcast and our new channel. See you in our next video.